Hi, Cat's Cradle here. This is a video response to Arkansas Prepper's uh, 200 sub contest. Uh, congratulations, Arkansas Prepper. Uh, and I don't enter these contests just to enter them. I only enter them if I think I have something uh, valid to show that I would want to show to my uh, prepping subscribers anyway. And this is something I've been wanting to show. Uh, this is just about one of my favorite gadgets in the house. One of the things I was really concerned with uh, as I'm prepping, in case there is a, a long-term scenario where we would have a power outage, one of my big concerns would be how to keep my floors clean. I have hardwood in the kitchen dining room and uh, back in this area uh, where our desk is, and I have no problem sweeping that. That's not a big deal, but we have uh, a fairly large house, and I have two indoor dogs and I think it would be maddening not to be able to keep my carpets clean and to keep the hair off of them uh, that would absolutely drive me crazy and so I was trying to figure out a solution to that and I found this little sweeper I have disassembled it for you so that you can see how small I can get it I can actually throw it in a bag and take it to school uh, I have a reading area in my room that has a carpet and um, the janitor doesn't drag around a carpet because nobody else has carpet except me. Uh, so if I want to sweep that uh, carpet, I can just put this in, disassemble this and put it in a bag and cart it up to school and nobody knows the difference. Uh, I can vacuum my little carpet up there and bring it home and no problem. It's incredibly lightweight. Let me see. Um, uh, I was just looking at an ad for one and I don't see the poundage on it, but I don't think it's over two pounds, uh, if that. It's very, very lightweight. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and put it together. Here is the handle. Here is the little motor head. Uh, this is, I mean, this is the one that attaches to the handle. I'm going to go ahead and put it together and show you what it looks like. Alright, it took me about two seconds to put that handle back together. I pulled out the little door here. This is the little door that collects all the um, the debris you sweep up, and you just you just pull this right out and just dump it into your into your trash uh, bin. So that slips back in there. It does have, uh, believe it or not, a little rotating uh, brush head here that um, that brushes up your debris and puts it in that little tray. Here's the button that you press to turn it on. Alrighty. Uh, it is cordless. Pardon security patrol there. Uh, so here's, uh, when, you, when you're when uh, you charging it, this little red light comes on. So in the back here is the little place where you plug it in. And let me show you that. Here's the little little adapter thing or whatever you call it. Plug that in and then you plug this into your wall. And I can charge it uh, in just a couple of hours and it's ready to go again. On the ad it says it'll run for 40 minutes. If I'm doing carpet, uh, it won't run for 40 minutes. Uh, but I can probably sweep for 15 or 20 minutes and in 15 or 20 minutes uh, that's really all I need to do because I really just do a quick pass with this kind of thing. If I want to do heavy duty vacuuming, I use my big vacuum. Now, uh, I, I am, I don't delude myself into believing my carpets are really clean when I use this because it's really just brushing things off of the surface. There's no, uh, there's no suction per se. It's just sweeping up what's on the surface. So if I want to do deep cleaning, I get my big vacuum out and, you know, suck, suck, you know, deep down and get the dirt out. But this certainly is getting everything off the surface and I am astounded at what this picks up. I haven't swept in several days, so what I'm going to do is I have a hallway that's about 75 feet long. It takes about three passes for me to um, uh, to get that hall uh, cleaned to make a pass down. I may go down one side and the other side and then down the middle, and I will show you what this looks like after three passes, okay? Uh, so here he is all attached. There's the, you know, there's the handle all the way up. It's just lightweight, wonderful. Uh, I will show you right here. Uh, I noticed that it is on sale at Aldi's. That's where I got mine. They run it on sale periodically, or they only have it in stock periodically. And it's $19.99. What a deal. I, had, I did not have very high hopes for this 
uh, little gadget. Uh, I, I couldn't believe that something so lightweight and so inexpensive could do a very good job, uh, but I didn't think I had much to lose. I was willing to risk $20 on it. I have been very pleasantly surprised. Uh, there's just nothing it won't do. It'll do the hardwood floors, and it'll do the uh, carpets, and just sweep up what's on the surface. It's awesome. So let me go make that path, and I'm only going to do my haul, uh, and I'll show you what the little receptacle looks like um, when I get done. I'll be back in just a minute. All right, I'm back. I spent about five minutes on my haul, and you can see what it picked up. It will pick up dust and lint and little pieces of paper and animal hair and yep just dump that right into my trash uh, for the twenty dollars I think that this is an awesome little machine I really like it uh, and the great thing about it is what I was thinking is since you know you just use this little zapper it doesn't draw much power I'm thinking that um, you know when I'm if I needed to run my solar generator and just plug this in and charge it up, it wouldn't take much, it wouldn't draw much. Uh, and that way I can at least keep my floors swept up and I highly recommend it. Uh, for 20 bucks, you just really can't go wrong with this product. Anyway, Cat's Cradle, out.